this button and say hello and welcome to this final boss fight live stream. My name is John and I'm not capturing Minecraft. Oh, so I am capturing Minecraft. I'm not turning my light on though, let's do that. Hello! Hello and welcome. My name is John and this is Sean. Hi. And this is uh, Naked Sammy. I mean, he's got no skin yet, so um, yeah, he's a skinned Sammy. <laughs> I don't know if that's worse than what I said or not. Yes, definitely worse. And this is most of Maddie's skeletal structure. Yeah. I finally started building people. It was going to happen eventually, let's face it. I mean, there's whole sorts of ethical things about playing God that we should possibly discuss, but... Eh. Are you building a plaid shirt right now? Yeah. Except I'm not really appreciating the red nether brick. It's just not doing it for me. So where are we, Sean? Because I don't recognise this place. This is the Batcave. <laughs> no. Are, are you Batman? Shh. <laughs> no. Unfortunately, I am not Batman as much as I would love to be Batman. I'm just, I'm just not. Is this, this is the my, Sean my, Cave? My, my, my workshop, yes. I have a nice island, as you can see, out through various windows. If you flick onto the map, it's in the ass end of nowhere. Uh, very much. Uh, yeah. I don't imagine you've got a huge amount loaded around it. Pretty much just the island from when I came here when you hadn't built anything. Yeah. There really isn't a lot around. It's, it was one of the places that I found on my ridiculous missions. And I thought, screw it, I'm going to do something with it. So this is the workshop. This is where I shuffle away to go and do some chiseling. This is where you do your mad science. Wah. Yes, exactly. Okay. And... I'm people building. Cuz you know, someone's someone's got to work them shops. When you when you need to make friends and well, I mean literally you're making our friends right now. Yeah. It just happened that I had the right colors around to sort out Sammy first. Um I was going to say Sammy... is there is there favoritism here or No, I just happened as I was pulling out the colors because I've been going through, you, you'll see the various chests that are beginning to fill up. It just happened that I like working through the rainbow, and red comes first, and I designed a red shirt for a certain Frenchman, so... Uh, well, fair enough. It, it just happened that way, but so, I quite like it. So, tell me, what's the, what's the plan for this when you're done with it? Do you break it and bring it over, or do we copy it? I mean, either. I was kind of assuming I'd probably just break it and bring it over, because I'm not sure I need my very own, very own Sammy. I mean, it kick him out of the place, but you never know. I don't. I don't know if breaking and bringing Sammy over in four pieces is better or worse than just yeah, having I'm... two of him. Yeah, I'm not sure. As long as we assemble him again in the right order, I think that should be fine. Yeah, I did think at some point we could Frankenstein them together and have some weird, uh, weird samedy. <laughs> Given that they're in the four pieces, you could do like diagonals of one and the other. It would be quite funny. <laughs> it's kind of like the worst way to Photoshop someone. Like this is what your child will be. Yeah. This Minecraft monstrosity is what your child will look like if you were Minecraft people. Wouldn't that be weird? I mean, we so should we should slightly do it as well, though. That. Yeah. Oh, hello. Hi. I'm I'm just testing out colours on the wall. I can see that. Because the grey is not doing it for me. I have bought you a present. Yay, present. Uh, I need a. Concrete. Ideally, two by three space to work in. Where would you like me to set up a thing? In this corner. Do you want me to pick a corner? Yeah. Uh, it's a fairly free room space within this room. I'm intrigued. Oh. 
I mean, you should be able to see what I'm doing on the stream. Yeah, well, I mean, I'm stood next to you, so... Or also that. <laughs> I mean, it's... Ah, oh, damn it. Dang nabbit. This is the problem you have with Minecraft. The... It's very limited. Uh... Colour palette buys. Like... It's quite difficult to figure out. Yeah, that'd be better. What I've had to do is I've had to go through, throw a load of items on the floor. Smash bits into them. Ah. Out of them. You are uh, having fun over there. I might, friends. I might be under I might attack a little bit. I might not have slept here very recently. So, um... Well, we didn't. We just didn't sleep through that night that just happened. Yeah, but I'm sure some of them didn't actually die in the day and have gained friends. Oh, hello. As Sammy is at the moment, you can walk up onto his hand, onto his shoulder and his head. <laughs> if only the real Sammy were this easy to get on top of. Yeah, that sounds all kinds of wrong. Can we quote that, please? I mean, to be fair, I've never actually tried. Maybe we should try at Comic-Con. Mm. Oh, goodbye, zombie. I mean, maybe we um, should ask Sammy first, but... Yeah, I think his opinion might be required before you just... just go start climbing on people. I don't know. Uh, would you like... Sharon? 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 Sharon. Yep. Uh, Ian. Yo. Uh, would you like this to be a private teleport yes. location? Probably. What's involved in a private teleport location? Uh, own. Ah. Oh. Uh, only people that have access to the porter can port to it. Oh. Which would yeah. be the two of us, basically. Cool. Random yes. underscore Shern. And whatever my name is. Sean, can you look over my head? What's my name? <laughs> Do you seriously not know? <laughs> is it John FBF? Yeah. Yeah. No spaces or anything. You can if you try and TP you can see your name if that Oh yeah. If that helps. Uh yeah there it is. That's me. <laughs> How do you not know your own name? I don't know my name for things. Surely it's a fairly standard name that you have for things. <laughs> So apparently this um, chiselled bit that I'm working with, this this one that I'm holding. That would be more impressive if I was still there. Yeah, it's like a pinky colour, but when you look at it, it says construction, foam, wall, black. So I'm not entirely sure who um, figured out what with their colours. but That but... sounds like someone may have messed up on the colour scheming. Yeah. Ooh, Steamed Chew has done a new video. Ooh. The lovely steamed true. This plaid shirt isn't working very well just yet. I'm hoping that once I get more of it done, it will it will come together. It's just a little bit mottled, so you lose a bit of the pattern. Right. Yeah, I mean, that's the problem with a lot of Minecraft blocks, though. They're very But I think mottled. once the whole... Yeah, I think once the whole thing comes together... I What's the thing I'm looking for? It is facade. What, what is the thing you're looking for? Oh, so many things. So many things are the things I'm looking for. All of the things are the things that you're looking for. Uh, stone. Stone. Is 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 one thing I am oh. looking for. I can actually layer the shirt. Ah, the maze balls. You can layer the shirt. Yeah. So at the moment he's got his like shirt just sort of open slightly. Right. And I can layer it. 
I also think he's a bit narrower than maybe he should be. He in in Minecraft or just in reality? I mean in reality he's a fairly slim guy, so uh <laughs> That was the maybe, wrong porter. Maybe he should just continue to be his slim self. Whoosh. A whoosh? I'm here. Hi. I whooshed. Yeah, this is black clip. Hang on. Eh. Uh, no, it isn't. That is pink. Yeah. That is pink. Or maybe salmon. But when you look at it, it says black. It does, and it is wrong. Oh, you're welcome to go and have a look around the island as long as you don't go in the front door. If you want to have a faff around outside. Nope, I think I am satisfied with you revealing your house when you have finished your house. Cool. Because it's your house. That's how house reveals should be done. Sammy has some of an arm now. Yeah, some of an arm, and the front of his shirt is earring as we speak. So, my plan for this episode... Episode? Episode. My plan for this episode uh, is to speak very funny, and it'll be hilarious. Yep. I mean, you're not wrong. I'm but gonna give up on it. You gonna it, do but... anything, anything whilst you're, no. whilst you're doing that? No, just just that. It's, it's a one-trick pony thing. Ah, oh, fair. You're just gonna stand on. I'm gonna stand on for the entire I... episode. Yeah, it is literally just because you've got that fleshy hand in there. Because I can't do the same with. Yeah. I I can't walk up onto Maddie skeleton. Yeah. I can jump up onto Maddie skeleton because I can jump this high. Yeah. I think the plaid's working. Do you think? I think that's a Sammy shirt. Yeah. I think. Do you think he'll be proud of his shirt? I think also we really should have told Sammy by this point that this was happening. Why? Mostly because I've already told Sammy that this is happening. But... <laughs> and okay. I kind of expected that at some point one of us had. And it turns out neither of us have. Oh, fair. Um, I would have, I would have thought I would have done, but apparently not. <laughs> Oops, he is. Uh, what is that? What? What just? What just? What just took place? No. Oh. Twitch, why are you beeping all of the things? Don't beep all of the boobs. Stop with the boobs. Ah, uh, Theodas is saying that Nixit will make such a nice carpet. Ah. Uh, as Amy has just posted a new photo on the Discord <laughs> of uh, Nixit's character based on uh, a Hero Forge. Oh. Uh, th have you seen Hero Forge yet? Mm. Has anybody shown you? I'm going to go back. No, I don't think I have. Uh, it, it is a website where you can get custom 3D printed... Uh, D and D figurines. Ooh. And so it's. It's probably a good thing no one showed <laughs> me that because that would be. It is where Jeff bought the uh, 3D printed uh, SKT team that oh, he painted he for yeah, MCM. For. May was it? Yeah, the May. The dude that he is. Um, and so I'm guessing other people have now found it because Amy's just done Nixit on it. Uh, and also, I think he used it oh. for uh, Amy's Christmas present. Ah, very cool. Uh, so I'm going to actually say at some point what I'm planning to do this episode. Or are you just going to keep them waiting? I might just say I might just keep saying that, not <laughs> doing it, and then get to the end of the episode and not have done anything but delay saying what I'm going to be doing. Would be would be a rather backward stream, but. Hey, whatever floats your goat. I mean, to be fair, last time what I did was say we were going to do something and then 
somebody blew up half the world and I'm completely not responsible for that. And then... Uh, that was that was subtle. Real subtle. Yeah. So, <laughs> in light of that event that occurred that we're not talking about and is not my fault in any way, shape or form... Right. Uh, I figure it's about time we leave this planet. Yeah. Uh, I'm cool with that. Or... Uh, or at the very least, in in no way the way that this sounds, it's time for you to leave this planet. <laughs> that Yay, space explorers. No, because space exploration oh. is a thing that's in a different mod, and we don't have that mod. Interdimensional <sighs> exploration Ooh. and crafting of dimensions, however, is a thing we can do. So the exploration of the space-time itself and all of the universes is... Yes. But also I? also crafting our own. Because mm. why, why stop at building humans when you can also build places and dimensions and go live then there I instead? I can fill with all of my friends. Yeah. That I've built. We have nearly 3k cobalt. Do we need that much cobalt? No. But we have it. Eh, there. Um, but in light of that, exploring other dimensions is dangerous. Probably. It sounds it. Probably. And so I figure that we'll need even better armor than the armor we have. And we have some pretty yeah. good armor. But what yeah, is. Yeah, we, we are doing pretty well. What is better than the good armor we have? Well, by golly gosh, it's wyvern armor. Hmm. Uh, wyvern armor is the first step on the journey towards the ultimate armor set. At first glance, the armour in Dra Draconic Evolution may seem to be a fairly underwhelming set, but the actual armour effect of the armour is not the primary line of defence. All armour in Draconic Evolution comes with a powerful force field that is capable of absorbing massive amounts of damage. So, okay. basically, we're going to make Wyvern... or I'm going to make us Wyvern armour because it is stupidly powerful. Because why would we not? Um, also, my my dark armour is, is breaking. So yeah, it sounds like you might need, might need some more. It, it seemed like a good idea to build the next set of armour before it's completely gone away. <laughs> just, just stood there slightly naked, like, oh. My clothes. No one. Yes, this is very, very sensible. Uh, why have I not taught? Oh. Oh. We need nether stars. Stars. Of the nether variety. Okay, I think I fixed Maddie. Uh, okay. She's not built, but she just is slightly, slightly more normal proportions. Do you want to explain what about Maddie we've fixed? Because I don't understand. Well, I've just sorted out her normal proportions, so now she's a bit more like Minecraft character size. As Whereas... opposed to... Sammy, who is raking it up. Is Sammy not Minecraft character proportions? No, he's not quite as wide as Minecraft characters normally are. He's missing a couple blocks. Oh. But I mean, he's a skinny dude, so... <laughs> I'm rolling with it. I'm not redoing this plan. <laughs> I mean, he is... To be fair, they are a very skinny couple. Yeah. I may put Maddie back how she was, actually, to be perfectly honest. I might just change the uh, 
other one ready for pizza dude. I mean... How do we always have no sticks? That does seem to be a running problem we have. I get <laughs> the system. makes no sense. I get the system to build hundreds of sticks. And we're constantly running low. I wonder if something's using sticks. Well, I mean, the farm will be using sticks for the tools. Maybe. So that's at least one place that they're going. What is that? That is a furnace, John. Thank you very much, also me. <laughs> well done, me. I remembered a thing. I'm now building a mob grinder. Mmm, tasty. Uh, because we now need... To grind some mobs. To grind some mobs. Uh, so I'm going to head back... Actually, no. No. <laughs> you, you have an indecision troubles. There. I've I've decided to build other things before I head back to places. Okay. I think. Probably. So you know we've got that horrific scar in the world. Yeah. I'm gonna make I use have of noticed it. That. And I know that you've noticed it. <laughs> I know that you're not super happy about it. I'm not chuffed. No. Uh, I mean, that is part of the reason that I'm thinking we should send you off-world. Is yeah. because you'll be in a world where it isn't. <laughs> I, can, I can keep my pristine landscape. And we'll also not allow Michael into that world. I don't know, he can come and visit it as long as he's not allowed to uh, touch anything. <laughs> I don't know if in we can... In which case... Knowing my really irritating soul, I'm probably going to put in all kinds of things that are the wrong colour and don't match. Just because I know it really irritates him. Um, I should really set those up to autocraft, but I won't. It's just the kind of person I am. I kind of can't help it. Um... Or at least that's what I keep telling myself. So I'm going to go and build a wither-killing machine in Michael's Madness. Yes. That sounds like a good use for it. Uh, and hopefully I'm going to construct it in such a way that the Withers won't be able to escape. Yeah. How do you do that? What, what stops them from escaping? Uh, there are a number of Witherproof blocks that you can get. Right. Uh, the one I'm going to use is force fields. Okay. If I could remember shield. How or where? I only need a tier one. Because, like, I've never played with withers. I've not done Probably a lot with a them thing. either. I hear it's worse than playing with fire. Almost certainly. Holy moly, he's got two arms. That is a normal number of arms. How many wither skeleton skulls do we have? None. Well, really? Let's see to that. I thought we had something somewhere that was... Oh, we went over and um, killed them, didn't we? We uh, we have a thing that can summon the wither skeletons, and that we is we killed them over a pig, a mushroom, didn't we? We, we killed, killed a wither. Uh, we collected enough to kill one wither. Eh, eh. <laughs> oh, why did I build you there? Pass. Why did you build it there? I don't know. Uh, the grey points to the white. The greys all line up yeah. And the greys all line up yeah. It's very technical trying to get a plaid shirt to work. I would assume so. 
Do I want to just do that, or can I get something to better decapitate you with? <laughs> am I am I intent to just kill you, or are we going all out merciless? Well, I mean, I need heads, so I need to decapitate them. I didn't realise that was a thing you could specifically do. Uh, you can get said. you can get uh, swords that have decapitation on them. Oh. See, I've been missing all of this information. Uh, it is an enchant. Right. Okay. So it gives you a better chance of head falling off. I'm glad you didn't just end your sentence there. Lots of people are. <laughs> it's been an odd day. An odd day? Uh, where is Michael's madness? You put a point on it, didn't you? No, I put a sign on it. Oh, well look at it on your map. Oh, here it is. <laughs> I mean, you can't exactly miss it. I found it. It's this lake of devastation, isn't it? Yeah, that's the one. Turns out it's easier to find. Tell me that. It's this, it's this burning, horrible pit of desolation. Yeah, that's, that's the one. Here we go. This scar in the world will be where we spawn withers when I have some. Uh, Sean? That is my name. Does your house happen to have a bed? Uh, yeah, if I go break down this door. Could you possibly go and make use of it? I haven't quite turned it into my dream bed, but it has a bed. And it's blue. I mean, those are both very good things. There you go. Thank you. I got to Michael's Madness just at night time. Standard. Uh, so I think 5x5 five five should be enough. Right. Five. That looks big enough. Maybe. Ooh, what are the... Who? What? What are those? Uh, these are shield templates. Oh, okay. So basically, I build out of these one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, where did I not build yet? So I need to build along this. Yeah, I build out of these, and then I place the force field generator underneath them, and uh, okay. uh, it generates the force field where these are. Right, I see. That makes mostly sense. And so I think I can just put that there. Put that there. Remember, I haven't actually linked that to anything yet. And I don't have any conductors with me. So, all in all, this is going incredibly well. All in all, relatively successful. Also, I didn't set up a waypoint at Michael's Madness again, so... <laughs> oh, man. Going well. I reckon 64 plus 16 is a number. Yeah, that's definitely how numbers work. Also, that's how much wool we had left, so... Cool. On the other on the other plus side, the Frenchman now has a shirt. I'm sure many people will be happy about that fact. Probably, especially him. Yes, his, his uh, chest will not be getting cold or exposed. Terracotta box. 
we have two wither skeleton skulls. Phil, that could be Yay. faster. What am I doing? I'm such a doof. Largely, I just head towards the end, and then that's where the vast field of devastation lies. Yep. Oh. He's got no hair. Oh my god, he looks creepy. What did you do to his hair? He had hair when I came over. In fact, when I first came over, that's pretty much all he had. Yeah, I had to, I had to take his hair off. It was too pale. I wasn't liking it. He needed darker hair. Maddie will be very disappointed if he has no hair. It's okay. He has hair again. It's fine. Yay. Nobody panic. <laughs> it was just a quick, quick shift of hairdo. You were just dyeing it. Just, yeah, I just didn't. I just didn't like it. It just wasn't him, you know? Oh, fields of fire. Oh, boy. I'm on the plus side, this bit's regrown, so... Stop flying now! What colour eyes does Maddie have? Uh, oh, green. Cool. Grey-green. Grey-green. Okay. I mean, that's probably a bit too technical for Minecraft, so... Let's go with green. I mean, you say that, but there's more options than I thought there would be. Yeah? Yeah, because, like, you can chain, you can do all of the terracottas. Fair. Um, which I wasn't expecting. And you can do the... Uh, you can do... There's a whole range of different construction foam walls. You can do different colours of sand. Uh, lamps, apparently, you can chisel. Which is a bit I to me. I don't know how that would work in practical there's, senses, but sure. There's concrete colours. There's all of the terracottas. There's, like, so many terracottas, it's ridiculous. Uh, all of the walls, all of the glass. Oh, dang it. Various stones and metals. Um, concrete powder you can chisel. You can chisel anti-blocks. I don't know what anti-blocks are, but you can chisel them. Some of the alloy blocks you can chisel too. Really, it's all good. I'm just trying to keep them in some sort of semblance of order. We should probably give, give our lovely Frenchman some trousers. Again, I'm sure he would very much appreciate that. Oh, what I should have done is the thing where I build the base out of a different... Yes. Yes? Uh, well, you'll remember this from when we were setting it up as a door. Okay. Possibly. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So with the force field, you can set it so that it reacts differently to different types of entities. Oh, yes. Uh, yes I do remember. So for this one, I can set it up so that players can walk in and out of it perfectly fine, but hostile entities cannot. Oh, okay. So we can keep him in there. So we can keep him in. And can you fit through it? No, but we can walk in and out of it and beat him up. Cool. And then if you start to get damaged, you just leave. Okay. <laughs> Screw this, I'm out. Uh, and then when you've recovered some health, you go back in and finish him off. Nice. Uh, alternatively, what we're actually going to do is have the a really powerful uh, mob grinder over here. Yeah. Uh, because, just, just away. because we can, basically. Just chomping through like it's nobody's business. 
This is not even. Is it? No, it isn't. <laughs> this is not even. You got anything else to add to that, or is it just not even? Uh, it's it, literally just that. No, it's it's not even. I made it five by four when I should be. I I was trying to make it smaller, so uh, four by four. Okay. It is. It is not even. Right. Well, that's that's my terracotta box. White terracotta is decidedly skin tone. White terracotta. Yeah. That is not the terracotta I would assume to be skin tone. Do we just have a lot of pale friends? I mean, arguably, there's more options for better tans than there are. Than there are for others. Hmm. Damn it, I'm like five blocks short. Oh man. That means I need wool. Time to shave a sheep. <laughs> It's not how I thought I'd be building force fields. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I assumed it would be to, to that, but hey, whatever works. I really wanted, there was once back in the day, like when I started playing Minecraft modded, uh, one of the mods was called Modular Force Fields. I don't, okay. I don't know if you ever played with that one. It was a really old uh, mm. tech mod. I feel like I recognise it, but I could just be entirely making it up. And it largely did what you would assume it would do based on the name it had. Yeah. Uh, it allowed you to make modular force fields. Force fields that were modular. Ha <laughs> ha. Yay. Um... I remembered that we actually have a machine that shears the sheep. Ow, ow, ow. Um, Charlie. And so, like, you you could build a force field that would do a number of things for you. And so, like, you could have force fields that were impervious to harm. Okay. Um, But they took a lot of power to power a force field that was impervious to harm. I mean, yeah, that's that's fair. Uh, but one of the options that I always wanted to build my base out of was that you could build a... I nearly just ran straight off the edge without sleeping. <laughs> uh, one of the options you could have was that you could um, have the force field place blocks for you. Um, right. So I always fancied the idea of building it so that your entire base was marked with uh, this is the bit that you replace. And so uh, you'd have your base um, built up and then if anybody tried to come in and get you... Um, oh, it would just rebuild the wall. They'd break the wall and then the thing would just go... Whoosh, and a new block would be there. <laughs> that would be so cool. And then you also would have... Um, you'd have, like, a, a chest next to the force field that placed the uh, block into the world uh, that uh, would instantly get refilled with whatever item it was that you'd just used. So you'd have to have a whole system that was like uh, checking which items need to go in the yeah in the thingy and then like pulling it out of your storage and then auto rebuilding it if it had to be rebuilt so that whenever anybody broke into your base all of your base would instantly be able to repair itself. It just lolled at them. Like K-Thanks by. 
but I mean, we're talking. This was years ago in like, uh, like one point four or one point five, like when literally, when Sean and I were first playing Minecraft. Minecraft. What the hell happened to this? What? Um. Is that a chunk? Uh, it looks to be a chunk. So maybe it's a chunk that didn't load during the blast. Yeah, it looks like that might just be one chunk that wasn't here for a moment. Because if it didn't load in the blast, then maybe it wouldn't... It wasn't affected by the blast. Yeah. Very bizarre. Oh no, I'm just, just clutching at straws. I thought you were building Sammy. Oh no, he's finished. Oh, are you building Maddie? Yeah. I lost a shield somewhere. I'm just trying to figure out how to get some differentiation between the sleeves on her jacket. Because on the shirt, the pattern changes a little bit. Which is why it works. I found a way to give her some really cool sleeves. Hmm. Maybe I can do some some coloured grey wool, perhaps. Oh, there it is. Do you want me to come and have a quick look? I mean, you can do. I'm also yeah. I'm also at a point when I can do that. So. Yeah. I'm just going to swing past Maddie's shop and pick up some supplies, though, because I'm I'm hungry. Getting the munchies. Getting the munchies, and I feel like some maple treats. Do you want pancakes or waffles? Mm. Uh, uh, pancake. How fast is that refilling? It's done. Yay. Automation no, works. Quick. Pardon? That was quick. I don't know, I was expecting it to take a little bit longer. It should have uh, enough in supply, like, as long as I don't take too many at once, it should have enough backlog to quickly refill and then... Um... <laughs> oh, that is Sammy. It is, isn't it? <laughs> Bonjour. Oh, that's a sleeves of a jacket. Yeah, I'm not sure which sleeve quite yet. Um, I'm just looking at other greys, and I'm trying to figure out, if you look on the back here, I'm trying to figure out how to differentiate the back of the jacket. I'm preferring the right-hand side. The right-hand side, to, uh, like this side? Yeah. I like the stripe on the left, but yeah, how to differentiate by like that works it's a difficult one so i will play with it yeah i will have a look see and see what i come back with also don't forget maddie has skin and uh facial features yep and hair. i had i had assumed that she might require those things i mean she has a cool jacket too so you know uh, that's where I want to go. Bye! That's way, way too grey. This is why these things happen in other places. <laughs> it's a perfect example of why this must be the way it is. Why you don't do things in the place you're going to finalise them. Yeah. Also, it's a very good reason as to why you don't make black jackets that are black. Yes. This be this be very true. Okay, I'm gonna test the wither skeleton spawning thing. 
And then I'm also going to need to work out how to automatically build a nether, a, a wither. There are a number of options. Star. What one shall I use? Let's let's put Maddie's hands on first, shall we? I'm sure she'd appreciate having some hands. I'm sure when she has a mouth, she'll say thank you. What was the pizza guy going to be called? It was a dude that turned up once. Uh, it was George, was wasn't it? Yes, George. I realised, by the way, that I got some pancakes for you to also enjoy. And then I didn't give any to you. What a jerk. Uh, so next time I swing by, remind me, and I shall give you pancakes that have only been minorly, mi minorly irradiated by being in Michael's Madness. Nice. Luckily, that's not a part of any of the mods that we have. Yeah. I mean, technically, actually, yes it is. It's completely a part of one of the mods that we have, but none of us are playing with it. That will... Oh, no, I can't have that for Maddie's face. Um, did I do a dumb? I did a... Did I do a dumb? Did you, did you do that? Did, did I do, did do I the do the dumb? Did I do a dumb? Don't know if mm. I did a dumb. Pink castle rune brick. That looks fancy. And no, that is not going to be Maddie's face. I mean, that... Doesn't sound like something that should be anybody's face. Mm. Oh, no, it's this, fine. I think it's this ceramic block is what I want. Okay. Oh, no, it's really pink. Maddie's face is very pale. Yeah. But getting the right kind of... Yay! The With best a... I've got so far is block of red quartz. With a killing Ooh. test one successful. Not very tall though. Like, I don't know, I was kind of expecting him to have a bit of headroom, but I don't know why I care. <laughs> why has he got a block in there with him? I had to put something in to stand on. Uh... Yeah, a lot of these a lot of these pink blocks are very pink. Can you hear him? No. Good. Good. Ooh, pale rose. Maybe that's Maddie's skin tone. Uh, what? Oh. Sean, he is... Ah, oh, fudge. I fell in a hole. And he's broken containment. Hi. Hi, we're both in a hole now. I mean, I'm in creative, so where's he gone? Oh, there. I mean, this may not be my smartest idea. Where's he gone? Where's 
a sneaky one. You've got um, skeletons as well. Although I think he's joining in the fight, if I'm being perfectly honest. doing creative mode because he doesn't really move very far. It's cheating, but eh. Uh oh. Stop destroying things, you big jerk. There you. when you're flying around. So that is the backup reason I'm doing this in Michael's Madness, is just in case he breaks containment, I'm already in a ruined chamber. What else is firing at you, oh, this, this is... There you go. Thank you very much. Got rid of those two jacks for you. Is that because he needs slightly bigger space? I don't know. So he can't like glitch through it, maybe. Maybe. But there's yeah. one way to test it. And that's to do exactly the same thing again. What's a what's a good sword? Um, the Wyvern Sword. How's that spelled? Uh, W-Y-V-E-R-N. Ah. Sword of Wyvern. Yep, let's have one of those. Yeah, you got out again. I mean, you made a mistake and climbed back in. Ooh. What was that? Is it a star-like thing that glows? That one. There you go. Thank you. Yeah, I think it probably needs to be bigger. I will get more shield. This is why you also test things before you finalize them and automate the process. This is why you also bring a friend in creative mode. That also helps. Do they only do damage downwards? And outwards, or can they do damage upwards as well? What with us? Yeah. I believe their initial explosion goes in every direction. But then beyond that? I don't know. I'm just 
just querying whether maybe you could have them at bedrock? Uh, I mean, in theory? Just, you know, like, general interest, not dig down there and try it out. <laughs> uh, I think you could. Uh, what was the other thing I was going to do while I was here? So, I think we decided that Maddie was probably Pale Rose. Do we think that's fair? I... Have a look at Pale Rose and tell me what you think. I will have a look in just a moment. In two shapes of a tail feather? Yeah, something like that. Oh, no. Pale rose ceramic you tile. You can't chisel it. Never mind. Ass. At the moment, she is a block of red quartz that apparently isn't all that red. Weirdly. Cannot explain to you how that is a thing, but apparently it's a thing. I will come and have a look and deliver you your pancakes in just a moment. Because mm. she's definitely not the same skin tone as resident Frenchman. Uh, no. Almost certainly not. Jeez. Oh, you can't chisel slime either. What a shame. I was just intrigued for other general reasons. I, I was going to say, are you have... going to make Maddie out of slime? No, I just suddenly had a thought that it would be hilarious to slime up a really thin layer of the floor and see whether you could bounce on it. Fair. Right, I'll be over in two shakes of a tail's feather. Just need to charge a present. Hmm. Intriguing. I wonder whether I can do a layer of... Some kind of... Yeah, this oh, that's a horrifying there. thing to look at. I know, it is, isn't it? That is just Maddie's skin. Yeah, but I don't like the random pink stripe down it. And what the hell have you got on your head? What the doodah is that? It is a Wyvern helm. Ooh. Try it on. Hold that foot. No. Now punch me. <laughs> Fun. So as long as you keep it charged up. Yep. You do realise I'm going to run past you at random points when you don't know I'm there and just make a noise. True. So just to point out, uh, if you look down in the bottom corner of the screen, you've got the new energy bar now. Yes, somewhere approximately behind your face. Yeah, somewhere here on my screen, obviously. Uh, let me just switch over to... It's, yeah, it's in, it's in your brain. Upper right mode for a moment. There it is. Uh, so that little green bar... Yes. ...is called Entropy. 
And so you can see underneath it the little EN number that's going yes. up as you hit me. The longer, the, the higher the entropy level, the longer it takes for the force field to recover. Oh, I see. So basically you can be hit a lot, but if you do get hit a lot repeatedly, uh, it takes longer for your force field to recover. Right. And so, so you can't just go and yeah, you, bash the hell out of her. You can't just keep taking damage for the rest of forever. It will wear out and the batteries will run out as well. Okay. Minecraft eyes are big, aren't they? Well, there's two different ways that you can do them. Is Maddie getting bigger eyes than Sammy? Yeah. I mean, that's fair. I mean, it's... Oh, what am I? Oh, hello. I saved a screenshot. <laughs> Yay. Yeah, see, I've got smaller eyes at the moment. But you've also got, like, the eyebrow, or, like, is that eyebrow or eyelash? Uh, I was kind of going for eyeliner, I think. Fair. Sort of. It's a bit chunky, I don't know. I'm not quite sure. It's been ages since I remade a skin. I mean, as you can see, I've got glasses. Yeah. I can very much see that. Also now... I did think it could be quite funny to add some 3D hair <laughs> on both of them. I mean, they're both excellent candidates for lots of hair. Yeah. Although it does push them, therefore, if it's on top of their head, into the realms of the extra block. True. Which then might not quite fit with the roof. So, I don't know. I may be coming out the sides. having extra hair. Yeah, I can't remember how long Maddie's hair actually is. Like, pretty, pretty long. Pretty long. I, I know that it's. I know that she says it's not as long as yours, and she wish, wishes it was. I mean, I have what can only be described as a ridiculous amount of hair. I can attest to that as a fact. So you know. Yeah, that pink kind of works. I'm slightly annoyed by this stripe in her face, but. Is, I'm struggling for options. Is uh, Is there anything you can do about the face hole? Um, I think the only thing I could do is perhaps offset her slightly. Right. Yeah. So if she was like more in the middle of a block, she wouldn't get the stripe. Because the stripe is between two blocks. It's like the edge of that pink block. So yeah, if she was stood off centre, the line wouldn't be there, but... But then she'd be off centre. And that would also be annoying. And that would bug me to hell and back. So I'm not sure. For the moment, I think I'll roll with it. Yeah. Question. Is Maddie's hair lighter than... Uh, I, f I feel I feel that is a comparison I should know uh, are you still there? what are you doing in there? I'm trying to get in here because this doesn't have mob fluid in it and I'm curious yeah. to know why because we've not had mobs being killed in the other one for ages Is that how that works? Well, you yeah, I don't know. I might, I might offset her slightly at some point. We'll see. For now, she is, she is fine. What is it that we use that goes in the space of? Yeah, it's not squirrel. Is it silverfish can go down? Yeah, and butterflies. Oh yeah, uh, where's my butterfly? Butterflies are... you might have a black swallowtail or a blue duke. Blue duke. God dang it. 
No. The bunnies go pretty small as well, don't they? Yeah, apparently this is... It might I've... not be able to get past that block. I've, I've got too many pipes in one block space, I think. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, and I don't think... I think that's as small as you can get yourself. I'm still really gutted that, like, you can't fly. I was really hoping to fly. That reminds me, when our uh, lovely chum that is Spammles occasionally thinks about Minecraft, yes. although it's it's a rare thing, he has no um, no custom skin. No. Which I think is silly on many parts and should be rectified. Oh, hello. Suddenly ended up on top of Maddie's head. Wasn't where I expected to be at all. I'm sure Maddie was also quite surprised. <laughs> yeah. I can imagine she was. Have I done... Hmm. Hmm. Well, the villagers have arrived. Villages have turned up. <laughs> I need some more fluid ducks, apparently, because... Fluid ducks? I can't hear ducked. I always just hear duck. I need some fluid duck. Yeah. Give me them fluid ducks. Uh, actually, I need fluid conduits, so... Aww. Okay. Uh, da, da, so, bye, far. Da. so far, Maddie has a bob. It's a lovely bob, but it's a bob. I mean... I'm... Not... not this is short hair? Yep. Yeah, she she has more than a bob. She definitely doesn't have just a bob. I mean, unless unless she has an extreme makeover with her friend tonight, but I think Sammy would be very upset. I mean, I'd be upset. I mean, I'd be happy if Maddie's happy, but I doubt that Maddie would actually be happy if somebody just gave her a bob cut. Would be a bit of a shock to the system. That's that's for sure. Uh Foozed Quartz. Foozed. It needs to be foozed. Make me foozed. Cactus power. Activate. Yes. Saying her magic words, Sailor Cactus. <laughs> sweeps into the fight. Like say Sailor Moon, but with with cacti. In case you were struggling with the pop cultural reference I was alluding to. I were. had I had guessed. Not that I've seen any Sailor Moon stuff other than countless numbers of cosplayers. There are a lot of those. Um, oh. I used to watch it. It was one of the early animes I watched. I did a fail. Mostly because it was it. one of the only animes that was actually on. I like not many of my friends like while I was in school watched anime, so I didn't really have any reference point, I guess. Just to, to make my start in the world of anime. I think I am going to have to offset Maddie. It's this pink line is driving me mental. I'm already a tad mad. Like, let's let's be real about it. But 
it's just just pushing all of the wrong buttons. Okay, we're getting a few more spawned, but are you just not running anymore? Dark room. I don't think it is. I've not heard it kill stuff in a long time. And I don't really understand why. Can we take it out of the machine or turn it like... Uh, I'm going to pause it for a minute. What, so it doesn't kill you? No, so it doesn't kill anything. Oh, maybe it was killing too fast. No, okay. it's... Nothing spawning in there. Weird. Very, because something should always be spawning in there. It's like the one place we want things to spawn. Let me go and investigate. Investigation away! Right. Well, this Get is on. this is Cursed Earth. As it should be. As it should be. And it is in darkness. So I don't know. Investigation over. <laughs> oh. It was a short investigation that solved nothing. Did it raise more questions than it answered, though? Largely. Sounds like the perfect investigation. I mean, on the plus side, we do seem to be getting more... Mob Crusher Essence. Which might be helping the situation? Well, it's, it means that the mobs are spawning again. Which hopefully means... It might means, not be making the situation worse. Which hopefully means that we're actually going to get more skulls. Which means I can make more withers. Which means hopefully they don't all escape. Yeah. Uh, but, that's, but... That's unhopeful. But also, hopefully, I can um, make us more of this awesome armor that gets us shields. Yay! Uh, it has blue trousers. That's an interesting song. Yep, my uh, update tune. Your your Maddie making song. Yeah. She has blue trousers. She has part of her hair. <laughs> and some of her face. She has she has a t-shirt. That's good. I'm just searching for the correct eye colour. Sort of greeny. Mm. Oh, hello. Pasted some random uh, wool on the wall, as you do. <laughs> blue. Let's see whether huh. any greeny stuff comes up in blue. I suppose also some of the problem with this area might be that it is actually also claimed by Erethusian. Ah. Uh. Although maybe if we talk to him, he might unclaim it and move to a place that he hasn't exploded or you could go build that again on mushroom island and we could leave him to his hellhole well i mean he didn't actually want the hellhole we just forced him or i just forced him to take it because he made it so it was his problem green 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 giant Green heart. I mean, also that. It's a colour of wood that I think is pretty. Would it work for Maddie's hat? Green heart. One word? Or one word, yeah. Uh, yes. Yay! Maddie has eyes. I've always thought that's a oh, that is a good thing about a person. They look adorable. Good, as as they probably should do. I fell off a thing. Much Aww. as much as Maddie will squirm at us saying that. 
Maddie's adorable. Aww. It was good. This morning she was too sick and I was too tired for her to argue with me on that. That was handy. Uh, I have got a... No, I haven't. Oh, yeah. Well, that can go in green. So that's from oh. green. I wonder if that was there. What's that? There may have been a hole in the force field. <laughs> Do you want me to come back over and help you test it again? I mean, I am going to be testing it again. It's slightly bigger now. I don't know whether to make it one block taller as well. So I'm going to make it... Am I going to make yeah, it... Yeah, while you're there, make it taller. While I'm here, I'm going to make it one block taller, and then, yes, if you wouldn't mind... Just to be sure. Just to be sure. Yes. If in doubt. Call you out. Yeah. Better to be safe, me think. Hmm. What is it, villager? I just realised that I've been searching for grey in possibly the wrong places. Oh, okay. Well, given that we've got lots of stone... Well, because we are infinitely creating been. it. I probably should have been looking at different types of stone for grey as well as wool and terracotta and I actually haven't looked at any of the different stones. <laughs> Which seems... Okay, Sean. Hello. Could you possibly stop, Maybe. stop by our base and check the computer for Wither Skeleton Skulls? And then with the skeleton skulls. And then meet me in Michael's madness. Yes. How did I end up back there? Ah, fun times. With the skeleton skulls. We've got five. Good. I need three. Okay. I have three with me. Spooky, scary skeleton. Ah. Hi. Hi. Right, I'm going to go make the thing now. Be prepared. Be prepared. This is looking positive. It is inside the box. He has some headspace. And now he should die. Maybe. Did he lose his health? No. No health is being lost. Aha! I figured it out. What? The block that was in here was in the way. Where's the stuff he dropped? Did you get it? Yeah. And I has it. Yay. That was all I got. Yay. Also, is it this way round then? What's that? Like this mob grinder. Do you reckon it needs to go? I don't know. I think it had the block in front of it as well, which might not have helped. Oh, maybe. I'm not sure. I took the block away. He died. He died. So, you know. I'm going to go build myself some more armour. And hopefully while I'm doing that, uh, the mob spawner will get us another doohickey. Ujimi floop. And I've still got your pancakes. 
Bloody hell, man. Hi. There you go. Thanks. You're welcome. I'm in creative, so I don't really need them. <laughs> but hey. But now you have them. Do I want to build the chest piece? I think I do. Oh, man alive. I checked out the middle of the... Ring of Doom. And I've been around the outside edge. It's not even uncovered the bit in between that. It's that big. <sighs> nice. So do you need me to hang around? Or am I safe to go back and try and finish off? I think you're okay to go back for now. Okay, okay. To the... Shop. I thought there were people here with me then. But it was just Sammy's lookalike. <laughs> and Maddie with no jacket on. I thought she had a jacket. Not a present. You, did you take her jacket off? Yeah, because I didn't like it. Okay. Because I don't think the colour's quite right. I need to just get all of the grey blocks out. And have a look at them all. And see which one talks to me. I have my new chest armour. Yay! I have now charged my new chest armour. That was quick. We have a really good charging pad. We do. Are we finally creating things that actually test it a little bit? Uh, we're getting there. She has skeleton arms. Oh, she's got adorable eyes. She has. I think they're. I think they're very pretty. Yeah, she's got little arms. See, so she's got no jacket on. Yeah. I like it though. Like. It's getting there. The rest of it. Yeah, she just needs to shuffle over like two blocks to the right. I like the... And then I think I'll be happy. Yeah. Also more it'll hair. Be... Yeah, it yeah. would mean that there's a line down her hand, but I can tolerate that. It's a finger. Well, yeah. But look. It's far, far more tolerable. Look at my awesome new chest place. I mean, you do look some kind of fabulous. It's definitely some kind of fabulous. Yeah. Punch me. And it continues to be a force field. Okay, you can stop punching me now. Oh. That was 25 entropy. Was it? Oh, sweet. That was just with a stone. Bye. Bye. Grey. What's the correct way to spell grey? Uh, e Y or A Y? Both are correct. Is one American? I believe that to be the case. I don't want to be the American way. Not how I envisage my life. Oh. Oh? I don't have my glider anymore. Oh. Uh oh. Decisions, decisions. Now what are you going to do? I uh, not glide anywhere is the answer. I can still jump. Oh. 
I mean, that's a good thing, right? How they don't hold on for long. What's that? Sneaky buttons. Like a pressure plate holds on for longer. Really? Seemingly. Or is that just on an iron door? Iron doors don't open and close quicker, do they? Don't think so. I don't know. Anyway. Grey. So I can make a cleaver. Okay. And a cleaver has beheading. Right. That sounds positive. And then I could upgrade the cleaver to have even more beheading. Okay. And then we can hit with the skeletons with it and hopefully get their heads. Nice. Also, I feel the other thing that I need to do is I was kind of planning for Michael to be here when I initially suggested I was going to start Draconic Evolution because he knows a bit more about it than I do and can set up uh, one of the key things in Draconic Evolution is fusion crafting uh, where you infuse or you fuse things together. I still am trying to glide and can't. <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna take you a while to keep. Yeah, I'm I'm land bound again. Um, where you fuse things together, and it looks funky. And uh, he was gonna he was talking about setting that up. You fuse things together. Yes, so we can upgrade our equipment by fusion. Oh. Okay. Interesting. Um, but quickly, because it's getting near the end. It's not quite the end of the episode yet, but I'm going to quickly see if I can upgrade this Void Miner. Oh yeah. That's a good shout. Uh, so, required for the next tier. We've got eight null modifiers... 56 structure frames. Why is too bright? Welcome to the thought processes of my brain. <laughs> The thought process sound fairly musical. Yeah. Okay, so all of those items can be chiselled. Oh, that was close. Was it? I nearly fell into the void. <laughs> zombie just died through the wall. <laughs> Amazing. Right. Maddie, Maddie, Maddie. How about grey wool and grey concrete powder? That looks like quite a nice combo. Grey rock wool is too close to grey wool. I mean, as far as I know, the rock walls are just the same as the walls, aren't they? I feel 
like they are almost exactly the same, but for some reason my head's saying they're slightly different. But I think I'm wrong. It's entirely plausible. What do anti-blocks do? I don't know. They appear to just be from chisel. Yeah. When you take a chisel chunk out of them, they go dimmer. Weird. Yeah. I spent a long time today having a search to see whether I could figure out how to make um, one-way windows. Yeah. I had no luck. No. It was sad. Right. So structure frame tier three is that. Yeah, that works. That'll be good. I'm happy with that. What's, oh, what's okay. that? I've just picked my colours. For Maddie's and jacket. I'm, and I'm happy with it, yeah. Yay. So, of so those... maybe by the end of the stream, Maddie might have a jacket. I need 56. How have I not set up concrete yet? Don't pass. I don't know. Well, I'm glad it's not just me. Oh, I don't have a transposer set up for it. Maybe that was why. George, I think I've got it. Who's George? Do I need to get to know this George? Uh, no, you're probably right. Is this the George that's going to be in the pizza shop? It could be. It's not at present, but it definitely is. Oh, Maddie looks adorable. Once again, I'm sure she'll have something to say on that matter, but she's not here at the moment, so... I just need to give her some lipstick. That is definitely a thing that she needs. That's a Maddie thing. Eh, maybe it's had dark. <laughs> I did not think that was a thing I would be saying. What, Maddie's lipstick's too dark? No. Oh, man alive, that doesn't work. Eh. Eh. Right. Right, I... Memo to self. Between sessions, automate concrete. Yes, this is a very good memo to self. Six. John, remember six. I I will at some point ask why, but for now I'm just going to accept it. Yeah, that's cool. I'm pleased that's your response. Just 
realigning Maddie. Yeah. Yay! So much better. Maddie realignment oh, yeah. complete. Go away, other Maddie. She fits in one block. Maybe I should move Sammy into one block as well. Would make transport far easier. Well, two blocks, but you know what I mean. Also means I can really creepily just stick Maddie, the top half of Maddie, looking out of random blocks. Should be quite funny. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, AG's stream. Thank you for bringing in some people. We are Hi. very close to wrapping up, but for now, hello and welcome. Hola. How are you doing, AG? How was your stream? Good, good. It was good, was the answer, Sean. Yeah, that is good. I'm not just randomly saying good. <laughs> Are you sure? I make oh. people, AG. A A AG says he forgot that FBF game day was on Saturday, not Sunday. Whoops. Ah. Uh, the next one's also going to be on a Saturday in a few months' time. I will tell you exact details at a time when I'm not streaming. Yeah, that's probably safe. Okay, other than the fact that Maddie needs her hair sorting out, she is done. That's good. This is this is progress. So progress, I tell you. Four laser cores and a laser lens. I have three laser cores and a crystal laser lens. Hey GW Senpai, it's going good, thanks. How are you? Hello. I am just building things for uh, the purposes of lasering. I'm making Magic just... Hair 3D, by the way. Just call him Greg. Uh, so how's how how is Maddie going? By the way, you were saying she is very very nearly done. She just requires a little bit extra hair. Yes, because you know she's got such lovely hair that I just can't not really. Uh, I'm sure she's blushing somewhere. She doesn't know why, but yes, probably. Her ears are burning and she's blushing. That's all she knows. What song is that? Mm. I'm not sure, John. I'm not sure. There's a song and we don't know what it is. Really Interesting. Wonder, really wonder if I should take away AG's abilities to do that. Uh. Then I also feel that, so... <laughs> I mean, I get the feeling... I get the feeling if I did take his abilities away to do that, he would somehow find... Like, he would still be able to do it somehow. He'd ninja his way in there and, yeah. and still mess with everything. In fact, he'd probably mess with more stuff because you Cause I suggested, suggested that he shouldn't. he shouldn't. That was a mistake, really, wasn't it? Or 
he'd just give me more admin power. Or he'd just play with the Minecraft server, Jeff says, showing up just now. Ah, uh, Jeff. Hello, Jeff. I've got a void miner that mines the void. It is now bigger and more powerful and beautiful. She has completed. And also we have a Maddie. I need more conduit. How do you mine the void? You fire a laser at it, good sir. Fire in my laser. And Sammy has some 3D hair. What's there to mine? Everything. Endless it's possibilities. Definitely want it. That's how it works, isn't it? What? If it's nailed down, you definitely want it. Yeah. Uh, John, 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 come and see. Come. I'll be right there. I should make a Jeff. At some point, definitely. Where's Jeff going to work? Jeff, where do you want to work? I'm going to stick AG in his turret. In the TARDIS. <laughs> I'm making people. I'm making friends that don't turn up enough. <laughs> AG says, you what? Oi, wait, back up. <laughs> okay, let me just pop over to Sean's shop where she's... I don't see what I'm up to. I've been busy. Just a second. Oh, wow. <laughs> we have friends. Oh, hello, Maddie. Hello, Sammy. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> oh, that's awesome, says Jeff. So, yeah, Jeff, Oh, look at working? their hair. Look at Maddie's hair. It's all wispy and, like, long. Yep. And, like, the jacket and the cactus shirt. Although it does yep. look like a finger pointing slightly. But I yep, suppose I'm it could also be that. giving a thumbs up, so that works on multiple levels. It works on all kinds of levels. And that that lipstick is, that lipstick is very red, which she would appreciate. And the yeah. eyes are cute and adorable, and Sammy's eyes are slightly closed and, like, sardonic, which he would also appreciate. Yep. And he's got the little beardy thing, and he's got his plaid shirt. And his curly hair. And his curly hair. And he's yep. adorable in his own way. Yep. GW yes. Senpai says that is just too lifelike, and he doesn't even know who we're talking about. AG says, can we fast forward to the part where I'm sitting on a toilet? <laughs> yeah, I thought I could um, put you in the teleporter. <laughs> you know, the one we sorted out for you. Shall we go visit the... Uh... Boots up the console. Shall we go visit the TARDIS? <laughs> I don't know if we've shown it on stream yet, because AG's not been here. Can we, uh... Can we share your TARDIS with the world, AG? I just hope the, str the, the Minecraft server doesn't just suddenly go down, because he is threatening to be booting up the console right now. He says, go for it. I'm, before we do that... Uh, Sean, if you want to head over to AG's, I'm going to finish plugging the, uh... Uh, plugging the stuff back in again. Yeah. You can, um, you can teleport to it. It's got a teleport thing, hasn't it? If we... Uh, I think it's got a receiver, yes. AG, public, matter receiver. Yep. We're all plumbed in. It is slightly disconcerting Aww. now that I've moved the void miner to come into the mining room. Yeah, that is that is a tad disconcerting. Oh, actually, I know what I'm gonna do. To the workshop. Oh hello. Every time I come to the workshop I 
teleport somewhere different. That's quite funny. Ah. I had I had a smart idea that I should put Sammy and Maddie in their respective places. So the void miner is it's void bit, mining again. Day two eighty of various things that I tried that may or may not have helped Minecraft. Uh, I have. So wait, have you? Just tried to turn on my glider again. <laughs> Can't wait to have the proper flight. Yeah. You've put them in place. Oh, yeah. they're in place. They're in yeah. place. Oh, look ah. at them. It's so great. Oh, it's wonderful. <laughs> Maddie's maple marvels and Sammy's savoury snacks. Supplies. Damn it. <laughs> He's slightly low on supplies at the moment, but... Oh, and we have a shout-out for your beard, John. Yeah, I'm, I'm just showing it off. <laughs> I, I, I'm liking it being this long. I've, I'm, uh, I was looking at beard trimmers the other day to see if I could get one that like would neaten it a little bit, but... None of them really go long. No. I mean, trust me, Jeff, it was... I haven't changed its... I mean, I have changed its length since Saturday because it's been growing, but... Uh, so where is Ag's Turdus? Oh, wait. It's a... Never teleport. It's a Pelly Torter. I'm going to keep growing it. I might keep shaving... How like... far? I don't know... I mean, I need to I need to do the cleanup uh, step again at some point, but I need to recharge the uh, razor as well. Uh, but I need to like shave this bit down. Uh, Ag dial. Welcome to Ag's teleporter. Feel free to step through, Sean. I shall. Welcome to the Turdis. <laughs> <laughs> the details, the detail. I mean, it it is incredible the amount of detail you put into a silly joke. <laughs> Yeah, but I mean, you've you've got to do you've got to do it properly, man. It's it's insane. It's. I like the colour of the toilet water. <laughs> it's all those silly little details. I mean, Ag's teleporter is definitely a uh, a portal to hell. See, when someone says to me on the server, "Can you TP me?" It works on so many levels. It does. So the question still stands. Where's Jeff going to work? Uh, it's a very good question. Um, I do love, do love the holes in the roof. Also, the toilet is filled with glowstone, so the... Uh, Toilet lights itself, <laughs> like in the cistern. What, if you stand the on the roof, you can see into it, and it's glowstone in there, so that it's lit. I would be able to stand on the roof, but my 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 uh, trousers just ran out of power. There you go. Okay. Oh, so it is. Yep. That's why nothing bad spawns in his toilet. It's a self-lighting toilet. 
Yay. The joys of modern technology. Yeah, so I've been all kinds. Yeah. We still need to make George the Pizza Man. We still need to make George the Pizza Man. We need to continue making... Uh, we need to work out uh, automating wither spawning. Um... Because I need to pick a window in AG's place. AG needs to pick you out a window in his place. Well, yeah. I keep myself busy. <laughs> Very apparently. Back to the workshop. Where am I going to tell it this time? Oh, no, roof. I like my teleporter waypoint <laughs> debris might have got slightly confused. Well, I mean, you've got the matter receiver now, so... Yeah, but I left that back in the workshop. Okay, Jeff. That's not concerning. <laughs> Only slightly. I'm going to go back and look at the uh, full-size stained glass window because, you know, still my best achievement yet. Well, I think it's also time to wrap up the ep I just threw that down on the ground and I did not want to. It's time to wrap up the episode, so I think that that's a good place to do it. Yeah. Uh, from, your, um, from your chair that's got a dog sat in it. Good Go damn on. it, Mac. Come on, dog. There we go. <sighs> Yay! So, guys, we've started uh, Draconic Evolution. Uh, we need to work on getting some Wither Skeletons, which we will do by uh, continuing to do the stuff we've been doing. Uh, Sean has started the job of building up the town. Uh, yeah. So we've got our first inhabitants in the form of uh, Maddie and Sammy. Uh, Sean is the blacksmith, so that leaves a couple of other shops for Jeff to work in. And AG's got the Turtis that he can be sat in. <laughs> yeah. Um, GW Senpai says just make this but 20 times longer and it will be the uh, mess, the dining hall from Hogwarts. Ah oh, man, I need one of those. Can you imagine the chisel and bits on that? <laughs> well, it's largely you just take the middle of the table and just repeat it. Yeah, but it doesn't work like that because you've got to put supporting legs in. True. Because you know, things have to work properly, John. It's a wizard's table. Do you think they care about physics? Weirdly, yes. Um, apparently Jeff is seeing the window at the back for the first time. Really? Where have you been? Apparently. Um, so we've started... I spot the odd in there every so often. <laughs> we've started on Draconic Evolution, which is going to give us some ridiculously powerful weapons and armour. And next time I will be jumping further forward, hopefully, if we've got the bits to make the rest of this armour. And uh, maybe some of the insane weapons. And uh, Michael might be around to help with the fusion crafting. Um, I hope so. Sean has built the first residence, so who knows which particular building task she'll be working on next time. Maybe more people. Maybe more buildings, maybe more yeah, something we'll else. Who can say? Who knows? Um, in the meantime, we have other streams. If you've liked this, by the way, please do hit that follow button. It's a great way that you can that will let you know when we go live, and it's a great way that you can completely for free support the channel. Yay! Um, on Wednesday this week... Um, Tanny is taking the DM's chair and running for us 
curse of this vampire dude, uh, in which we are now in the scary haunted world of there's a giant heart on the back of my throne. That is a very, very scary world. Have I only am I only just noticing that for now? Has that been there for a long time or is that new? Um the heart is relatively new. It was a dick before. Not gonna lie. I Does it also say hey? It also says hey on the back of the yeah. chair. That would probably be Michael, let's face it. Uh so yeah, curse of some vampire dude or this vampire dude. Uh, we are in the scary world of Barovia now, and we can't leave. And Sybil and Creed are taking this incredibly well. I'm rather cranky about it. <laughs> um, and so we'll see where that goes. On Friday, Sammy is DMing Space Odysseus's A Team game, uh, where we will be uh, f starting the Battle of Loeb. We kind of started it a little bit early last time with the amazing stealth work of our stealthy stealth muck friends uh, who tried to stealth into the enemy camp uh, well done them um, and nearly got poor Jeff killed when he wasn't there Aww. Poor Jeff. Uh, but we will be being joined in this probably hopeless endeavour where we're all going to die by our good friends the B team of Space Odysseus um, so tune in for that. And then on Sunday, we get back into Waterdeep for the continuation of Storm King's Thunder, where the crew are exploring Waterdeep and trying to find Jeff's potentially homicidal megalomaniac wife. Um, he knows how to choose them. He certainly <laughs> has a way with women. Uh, so tune in for that, and Sean and I will be back for more Minecraft next Monday. For now, farewell. Ex-wife. I mean, can you really call it ex-wife if there's been just a separation? You've not actually divorced? <laughs> yes. Apparently you can. For now, guys, thanks for tuning in this week. Uh, if I hit the credits to the credits roll, it'd be really nice I mean, that's if what they, they should do. It'd be really nice if they did and there was something on them. Where's the button? There's the button. Roll the credits. For now, guys, thanks so very much for being here. We'll see you next time. Bye, guys.